When I was a little girl, I was fascinated by the people that came before me in their history. In the fifth grade, I even helped unearth objects created by a vanished culture. When you think about it, it's pretty amazing that we even have a lot of these ancient objects in museums throughout the world, given they're under constant attack from corrosive gases in the environment that cause severe damage. Silver, a metal prized throughout history, is especially susceptible to tarnishing. I'm sure you've noticed the black silver sulfide tarnish layer that you have to polish off your jewelry at home. While polishing may seem harmless, it actually damages the object by removing metal. So with too much polishing, you'll lose all of the original surface details. The best way to protect your silver is to apply a coating. And currently, museums use a plastic coating that lasts about 10 years. At that 10 year mark, the coating has to be removed, the silver polished, and a new coating applied. For museums with thousands of silver objects, this creates a nearly constant cycle of damage and recoding. My research is looking to break that cycle by creating a new coating enabled by nanotechnology. I'm looking at replacing the plastic coating with a new transparent ceramic coating that I apply one atomic layer at a time. This technique is called atomic layer deposition or ALD. And this atomic level control over the coating thickness allows me to create films that are nearly invisible. In fact, when I did a blind study with art conservators, they were unable to distinguish between a silver knife with an ALD coating and one without. I found that the ceramic ALD films lasted 15 times longer than the plastic coatings. That's a huge improvement. For art conservators, this means that instead of every 10 years, they could wait 150 years before having to polish and reapply a coating. Additionally, I found a way to completely remove the ceramic coating without damaging or significantly changing the silver object. This is a critical step if we ever want to use these films on real art objects. So not only do these ALD films last longer, but they can be removed without damage and replaced in the future. Our research is a completely new application of these coatings, and it could revolutionize the way that museums protect objects. I've shown the fundamentals work in the lab, but next, I need your help for funding to scale up the process and test the coatings on real objects in museums. Advances in nanotechnology, especially in ALD, allow us to better protect the fine details of our history so that one day we can pass them on to our future generations and they too can connect with our common past.